What's up, YouTube? We're back. It's your boy, Mad Stacker. And we're here because I'm walking on silver. Hey, walking on silver, does that work? I mean, you can walk on sunshine. Can't you walk on silver? Yeah, you probably wouldn't want to walk on silver. Unless it was like a silver walkway or a silver bridge. But that would be a lot of silver. Okay, I'm sorry. I was grasping for straws whatever you want to call it i'm here because i got a great deal on some constitutional half dollars can you guess what kind they are you should be able to based on how i opened i got this from my good buddy pe stacker he is a friend's friend this guy has had everything life could throw at him thrown his way and he still doesn't stop doing for this community. I am just completely blown away and blessed uh, by his friendship. Uh, he reached out to me and said, hey, I've got some walkers I'm looking to sell. Uh, don't need to break the bank on them. Just make me a reasonable offer. And... Uh, they're yours. So I think I offered them 22 times face, uh, which I called my, my coin shop at the time and asked them what they were buying them for. And uh, they told me. So I reached back out to him and said, hey, they're buying them for these. I'll pay this much and throw in uh, a little extra for shipping. So it came out to 80 bucks for seven Walking Liberties. So, completely excited about this. Oh, wow. Look how he did that. Y'all see this? I got to get this so y'all can see it. He cut them into the cardboard. That's genius. It's kind of fun, too. Oh, that one in the middle is taped. All right, let me see if I can get it. There we go. Man, those are in pretty good shape. So let's check out what we got. What we have. I'm sorry, what we have. All right, that is a 1942. Man, these are pretty clean. That is a 1942S. Walking Liberty. That is a 1942 No Mint Mark. This is a 1945. Got a little bit of toning going on, but I don't care. They're walkers. No Mint Mark there. Man, some of these are in really nice shape. No Mint Mark on this one either. And that is a 1946. This one is a 1942. D. So we've got a P, D, and an S. This one is a 1943. No mint mark. And this one is a 1947. Huh. She looks cold in this one, doesn't she? Lady Lady Liberty's cold. You don't typically see that. So this is a 1947 no mint mark, I believe. Yeah, no mint mark. All right, so here we are. We've got 1942P, 1942D, 1942S. 1943 no mint mark or p if you will 1945 no mint mark 46 no mint mark and 47 no mint mark so uh i think this came out to 32 dollars and some change per ounce uh, if you do the math i was completely happy with that deal he said he was happy with it although knowing him he was he, he hooks me up all the time anyway. It's like, you, you just, Corey is, 
PE stacker is next level kind of guy. He just, uh, he does so many great things for so many people. I just, uh, I'm blessed to, to know him. And if you know him, you're blessed to know him as well. Trust me. So if you want to get to know PE stacker a little better, you can very often find him in the madhouse. Uh, this is, should be airing on Monday after the, uh, coin show weekend. So, uh, tomorrow night we'll be doing boxes as usual back in the madhouse. Come hang out with us. Look for PE stacker. Tell him how awesome you think he is and make sure you click his link below and go give him a sub and tell him Mattis stacker sent you and <laughs> I just called myself Mattis stacker. I'm streaming on the other channel too much. Tell him Mad Stacker sent you and do not worry about fitting in because we are all maddest here. <laughs>